it's me Kylie welcome back to part 19 of the Sims 4 legacy challenge so today is going to be a very interesting part because we have David's birthday and we've also had Amy Lee age up now I've spent a couple of days off camera doing a few little things that we needed to do before we jumped back into this part so I'm so excited to say that yep he's gonna be aging up to an elder and I don't know how I feel about it he seems to be perfectly okay with it. But yeah, he's going to also take a vacation day as an athlete because um, he fit, like if he went to work, he starts at two. But I don't want him to go to work. And Poppy is just over here. She's just finished another painting. Now, she ages up in nine days, you guys. And I am... I'm really not sure <laughs> how I feel about that. I mean, hello. She was the person that we started in this like legacy and I'm just like not sure how I feel about it I'm not sure how I feel about it um over here we have Amy Lee now this is Amy Lee I'll give you guys a little close-up look of her she looks so much like David oh she's so cute I love her so at about four o'clock today five probably five o'clock I'm thinking 5 p.m we're having like a little social gathering for David because it's his birthday and, uh, yeah, we're just going to celebrate his birthday. Oh, Poppy's in here just having a little nap before the shindig starts. But I need her to get up, like, in the next hour or so. Look at the lighting, you guys. This is such a beautiful picture. I love the new lighting, you guys. I love the way it's just coming into the house. and It's just so beautiful. I love it. So, yeah, she needs to be getting up to make a birthday cake because, hello, David's not going to make his own cake, is he? No, he's not, Poppy. <laughs> so, I'm going to have her just have a little sleep, but she is going to cook his favorite cake, which is a, if we can do that option, uh, a strawberry cake. There we go. Cool. So, wake up, Poppy. Let's go. So, I've got a little bit of a story time. What is happening? No! <laughs> I wanted him to age up with his cake. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. David aged up, guys. Forgotten birthday. Well, oh, oh. Forgotten birthday. Floating birthday party. Get down from the bunk beds, please. Has nobody told you yet not to walk in here? That is so dangerous. Now come down, please. Thank you. He's like, oh, <laughs> I love him. I love him. Let's go ahead and have a look at David closely in Creator Sim, and we'll give him some elderly outfits. But yeah, so Poppy made that cake for nothing. But we're still going to have a little party for him. Don't worry. So he is now an elder, you guys. So we feel like we need to give him, like, an elderly makeover. So he's got quite short hair. I feel like he wouldn't wear, like... I, th I don't feel like he'd have long hair. I feel like he'd get it cut, you know what I mean? So we're going to give him slightly shorter hair. Something like... Mm, not really feeling that. I'm feeling... Mm, nope, not that. That reminds me of Owen from the Chesters. Uh, <laughs> no, girl. No. Uh, not this one. I feel like he would... I to Yes, I totally... Yep, that one. Yep, it's got to be that one. And then we'll just kind of make his beard a little bit... Oh, should we do a beard or should we do... No, because I feel like... Now that he's going to be an, like an older guy, like an old, well, he's an elder, Kylie, he's an elder. I feel like he would wear just like, just really proper, you know, clean cut shaved, if you know what I mean. Clean cut shaved. Is that even a word? To, what is going on under there? Is that even a word to describe what I'm trying to say? Probably not. But I feel like David would probably just have like a moustache. Like this. Oh, uh, I kind of like this. Also like this one. Um, yeah, you know what? I'm going to do that. And then for his everyday outfit, I'm just going to give him like a styled look. So if I cannot find... Oh, totally. Totally. Yes, boo. Rock that. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we could give him like a styly makeover. You know what I mean? Like give him... Oh, this is so adorable. I love it but I feel like David would be the type to wear like a cardigan um if, like something like this yes 
yes, this is so cute. I feel like he would be the type to wear like a little cardigan. Yeah, like this. And then we'll just like drop the sun, like the sunnies, the sunnies, girl. We'll drop them because he doesn't need them. But yeah, I totally feel like he'd wear this, like in the exact same color too. Or we could give him, oh, yes. Okay, we'll, we'll do the lighter one, okay? Okay, lovelies, we'll do this one. And then for shoes, I feel like he'd just wear kind of, kind of like these shoes here. Yes, totally. Now his formal wear, oh, yep, okay, that can all stay the same because let's be honest, he's going to be a really stylish, stylish granddad, you know what I mean? He, well, he's not a granddad because he doesn't have any grandkids, but you know what I mean? He's going to be a stylish dude. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, so because he's quite, you know, he's still quite athletic. He's got a lot of muscle still. I feel like he'd be a really stylish elder, if you know what I mean. Not a granddad, but you know what I mean. <laughs> you know what I mean. Um, and then, yeah, I'm, I mean, I'm totally happy with his outfits. Now, um, Amy Lee... This is her up close, you guys. So we're just going to give her a little bit of a makeover. So looking at her outfits right now, I'm kind of getting the vibe that she's going to be quite, um, she's going to be quite into denim. She's going to be into like jeans and all that sort of stuff. I really love this sort of outfit that she's wearing right now. I think I might give it to her in a different color. Okay. Um, I really like this green one for some reason. I, I really like that on her. And for shoes, I feel like she'd wear some little boots. Yeah, I do. I feel like she'd wear some little boots like this. I feel like she'd be, you know, the type of child to just kind of wear whatever and be happy. You know what I mean? She's not going to be too... Whereas kind of like Peyton Rose and Phoebe Ann were quite, you know, into like girly things. But I feel like Amy Lee is just more into... I don't know, just wearing kind of whatever, you know what I mean? I feel like this is her style right now. Um, obviously, may change in the future, but, you know, I'm only going with what I'm seeing uh, as, you know, with her now. Um, and, of course, we know that every single child that comes into the household gets something very special. So we know that Ashton has, like, this little round necklace, and then we have Annabella wearing a purple one, um, and then Amy Lee needs to get one as well. So I think with given pretty much all of the colors um i think i might do the yellow one damn you can't see it over the sweatshirt that she's wearing or like the top dang it okay well i will give her mm, i'll give her this yellow like kind of jumper with a little white um top or t-shirt underneath and then i will give her just like a pair of jeans like this are we feeling this? I feel like this would be her in, like, in an outfit. You know what I mean? I feel like this is her style right now. Um, now, for her necklace, we need to give her that, um, the butterfly. Dang, you still can't see it. Okay, so we need a different top. Um, what other top? We could do, we could do this one. This is beautiful. Yes, we have to do this, you guys. Should we do the lighter one or the darker one? This one or this one? Or we could do this one. Or I feel like that's too bright. Like, it's too light. I'm actually really liking this dark one. Okay, we'll do that. Okay, cool, cool. So we've given David an elderly makeover. And then we've given kind of Amy Lee her um, necklace for the family heirloom. Because obviously I like, you know, every single child that comes into the house to have like a piece of jewelry and this legacy. And the next legacy, it'll be something different like... I don't know, like a bracelet or, you know what I mean? Just something that we can remember, you know, this legacy by. So Poppy is in here absolutely feeling so confident right now. She is she is literally, like, real confident. Um, so I'm going to have her empty out the coffee machine, and I'm actually going to have her brew some more. I really would love for her to have a best friend. I feel like she needs to have another... Um, best friend other than David, if you know what I mean. I feel like she needs to, um, I feel like she needs to have, uh, sorry, I just got a text message. I feel like she needs to have a best friend. So let's go ahead and see who is on her best friends, like on her friends list, I should say. So she doesn't really know that many people. I mean, she knows Christine, but she's not actually that, like, on speaking terms with her, just acquaintances. Um, and she does also know Dina. 
She knows Tracy. She knows Bobby. I feel like she may be really good friends. Like, just good friends. You know what I mean? I feel like we could maybe invite Bobby over. So let's go ahead and invite her over, see what she's up to, see if she wants to come hang out for a little bit. I mean, I know she was the bachelor in the... Um, she was up for the running for Poppy's love, but she didn't kind of... Um, you know, she didn't get... She wasn't successful is what I'm trying to say. Um, so... Um, I'm just replying to this text. Is that bad? Probably not. Oh, 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 right. Okay. Should Riley Jane invite over classmate Hassan? Mm, not today because we've got kind of like a whole bunch of things that we need to do. So Peyton Rose got her grades up and Riley got her grades up. Oh my goodness. This is so good. Okay. So I'll go through all of the kids grades so you can see. So, oh my goodness. Peyton Rose is a, like a high school A. This is awesome. This is great. So let's just pause this for a second. Phoebe Ann is a grade A. And then uh, Annabella is a B. Ashton, B. Riley is a B. And of course, Amy is a C. Wow, this is so good. Now, and <laughs> Peyton Rose is literally just so pissed off at the surroundings right now. She's so pissed. She's like, why? I don't like these dirty surroundings. So Poppy is feeling really confident right now because she's just, you know, had a cup of coffee. She's feeling real good. You know, she's just ready for Bobby to come over. And I feel like we could have like a girl's night out before she ages up. Maybe in the next part, we'll go for like a girl's night out. Does that sound okay with you guys if we head on over for a girl's night to like the club or whatever? And there's Bobby there. Yay! This is so exciting. Here she comes. Yay. This is cool. All right. So, we need to... Did she do that cake at all? I don't think she did. No, she didn't. What happened to the birthday cake? Is it still in the oven? It's still in the oven! Poppy! What? How do we How do we resume it? Oh, okay. We, we can resume it by clicking on the oven. Okay. Let's go ahead and resume this cake. Okay, let's go ahead and resume the... Are you... Are you going to resume the cake? Why can we not? Okay, resume the cake. Like, I know we can't age him. Why can you not get to it? Why can we not resume the cake? Resume. Let's go. Why can you not get to it? Wait, you can. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on. Amy Lee, come and sit over here. What? What is going on? No! I wanted to resume that cake. Dang it! Dang it, guys. Dang it. Well, it doesn't look like we are having cake. <laughs> Let's go ahead and um, describe some painting stuff. We'll go ahead and hip bump. We'll do an impression. We will also tell a few little jokes here and there. So these two are just friends right now, and I really want them to be besties. I feel like these two have a bit in common because I feel like Bobby is creative, isn't she? Oh, yeah, she's bro. She's a romantic, but we don't know her other trait. So let's go ahead and ask her about herself a little bit more, get to know her. So, I mean, we could go out on a girls' night out next part with, uh, with, say with Peyton Rose, with Poppy, Bobby, we could also invite maybe Christine and Dina and Tracy and stuff. I don't know. What do you guys think? Would you guys like to see that if we go on a little bit of a girls kind of outing? I don't know. Let me know down below in the comments. So right now looks like Peyton Rose is just standing at the fridge. Are we frozen? What are we doing? Are we, are we standing at the fridge, staring into the fridge, wondering what beautiful things can lie inside of that fridge? What, what's happening, you guys? I don't actually know. Okay, that was weird. Um, so, yeah, I'm really, really happy that David has aged up, you know. He, he's having a little bit of a nap in the in the bunk beds. He's so tired. I don't think we should have had, like, uh, well, you know, we could have had a celebration. We could have. But, turns out, we didn't because someone, yes, someone threw the cake in the bin. Yes, you threw the cake in the bin. You did. I know you did. I saw you. <laughs> I saw you. Oh, look at them two. They're so cute. So cute. 
<laughs> oh, look. I love them. I love little Riley. She's adorable. Who is your favorite? You guys, let me know down below in the comments if we should go on a girls' night with uh, Poppy and Bobby. Poppy and Bobby. Poppy and Bobby. Poppy and Bobby. That is such a tongue twister sometimes. Um, oh, my goodness. These two are so cute. I love them. I really love our all of our kids. You know what I mean? But who is your favorite? Who is really your favorite? If you had to choose a favorite, who would it be? I honestly can't choose. But if I really, really had to... I mean, I'm really attached to Peyton Rose, and I'm really, really attached to Phoebe Ann. Like, I don't know. I just am. I'm so attached to these two. Um, in terms of Phoebe Ann, she will be aging up in... Oh, my goodness. Okay. So, Phoebe Ann will be aging up next part. So, we've got a birthday party for her next part. And then we have Annabella aging up, not for ages yet. So, seven days. And then, of course, because um, they're twins, right? Yeah, so we'll have Annabella and Ashton's birthday kind of around the same well, the same day sort of thing. So that's going to be another part. And then Riley Jane is not for another seven. So is she going to be aging up at the same day as the twins? Yes, yeah, she will be because she was she was born. Yeah, that's right. She was born because um, we had triplets. Yeah, so they're triplets. Wait. So they're all triplets. So they're all twins. So they're triplets. I don't get it. Are they true? I don't freaking know. But they're triplets, so they're all twin twi twiplets. I don't know. <laughs> what, is, what is it called, guys? Um, I don't know. Anyway, just a bit of fun and games there. Oh, no. He's feeling sad. Please don't feel sad. And that is not your bed. Go cry it out in the room. <laughs> I love him so much. I do. I really love him. Oh, he's crying. I feel so bad. Please don't cry. We love you. We genuinely love... Now you make a strawberry cake. Are you serious? Are you serious? Well, let's call to the meal then. Come on. It's okay, David. Now he's feeling flirty. Because he's like, oh, yay. They remember my birthday cake. <laughs> they remembered my birthday. So he's feeling flirty, which is good. Um, so yay, he's not feeling forgotten about now. Yay. Have a piece of cake. Have a piece of cake. Yep, you can. Oh, please don't feel sad. No. We love you. Let's try cheer him up, hey? Um, we will tell a funny story and brighten day. Alright guys, so I'm going to wrap up this part of the Sims 4 Legacy Challenge right here. Don't forget to rate, comment and subscribe. Next part, we should be going on the girls' night out and also having a birthday for Phoebe Ann. So yay, I'm so excited. I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys in the next part of the Sims 4 Legacy Challenge coming in the next few days. Bye guys.